Fast. His last two fights have gone a total of 178 seconds. Can Ryan Garcia make quick work of Luke Campbell? Are we in for a long? I love, I love what I'm seeing. I love this start by, by the young Ryan Garcia. The jab is the key for Campbell. He loves throwing it, and he needs to just punch it so sharp right now, laser sharp. And right now, Campbell is, is looking to time that sharp. Oh. Sharp. And right now, Campbell is is looking to time that sharp. Oh. Call. But right now, that was a little trip up with the feet, and you're going to see a lot more of that whenever you whenever you see a southpaw and all. Garcia has to be careful not to get over eager because Campbell, who never makes predictions, said, I'm going to knock this kid out. <laughs> we saw a Euro step there from Garcia as he lands the right hand. Garcia, Henry Garcia, Ryan's father, first trainer, also his translator. Ryan does would work better against southpaws. You buy that, Sergio? Well, listen, I've never heard a fighter, especially a young fighter, says that he prefers fighting southpaws. But look at Garcia heating up in the corner. Campbell trying to just avoid the footwork you've seen the first couple of rounds. You see Campbell up on his toes. Garcia much more flat foot. Seems like he wants to. Oh, left hand sends the kid down. And that's what he was setting him up for. Luke was looking for that overhand left. Now we're going to see what this kid's made of. An absolute stunner. And look at the face of Campbell as if to say, you wanted. I'm here, you got me! I mean, it kind of flows into what I was just talking about, guys. The flat feet of Ryan Garcia's planted there, not moving away from those shots. And Luke staying cool, I love this, the discipline. He knows he has the younger fighter hurt. Luke Campbell. And it was that jab downstairs that brought the, the hand, the right hand down of Ryan Garcia. That, he took that punch well. He got up and reacted, but what a left. Who says he could throw his left hook a million times and never get tired. Again to the body with the left hand goes Luke. Aside from the jab, that's Campbell's best weapon is his body punch. Oh, right hand, and that affected Luke a little bit. Comfortable out there. He took that big shot. He went down. He got up, but he's looking confident. Luke Campbell. He's taking some heavy shots. He's blocking them, doing well defense. And, and, and that's the reason because he has so, so fast hands. His hands are so fast, he doesn't need to move that much. Power punches through round four. 42 landed for Garcia, 28 for Campbell. But of course, Campbell known for his jab, so see a straight left. Campbell took that shot well. Yeah, it got his attention. Man. No, I think Campbell's looking for that same short right hook again. So this was a good round. Oh, he good round. For the left hook right at the bell, and Campbell was ready to go down. And that's Garcia's back. Right on the tempo, and that's that instinctive left hook that Ryan Garcia is known for. Now it's time for Campbell to show that. We're in Texas, and this is the forward with no respect. Eddie Reynoso saying to Ryan Garcia, you're young. Body shot. And he goes down, and now Campbell is down on a knee. Two knees. He's asking questions. He's asking, do I want to get up? Can I get up? It is over. Ryan King Ryan Garcia. Fire and ice from both fighters. More brighter, a bigger star from Ryan Garcia. Meet the future of boxing. It's Ryan Garcia. Are you watching Tia Fimo Lopez? Are you watching Tank Dell?